I still remember that when I was at school, I learned how a vacuum flask keeps liquids warm, hot. And I was amazed that someone could think of doing something with vacuum, which is the very definition of nothing. So I think that aspect about physics absolutely fascinates me, that a physicist can think of doing something or applying absolutely nothing to give an excellent result. And even though I moved away from, let's say, vacuum flask to optics, uh, the principles remain the same and I find that fascinating. Uh, I think what fascinates me about optics is the fact that I'm trained as an optoelectronics engineer, so optoelectronics or photonics is a field that uh, uses, the, uses light and light effects and applies them into areas which have not been thought of before. And that is something I find absolutely fascinating, that you can apply such a basic and fundamental effect to wide-ranging applications from security, healthcare, right up to the food industry, and of course the internet as we know today would not exist without photonics. So that's what fascinates me about light and optics. The aim of the Photonics Explorer is uh, the logo, the motto says it all, engage, excite, educate. And the idea is to uh, equip teachers and students with educational material that allows them to do hands-on experiments in the classroom and complement the existing curriculum. So it's not a demonstration kit, it's really a hands-on kit that, they ha that goes into the classroom and supports the existing curriculum. IS stands for Excite Youth for Engineering, Science and Technology and uh, as the name suggests, it's exactly what we plan to do. So I am CEO of this organization at the moment and personally this uh, opens up a whole new world for me because my formal education and my formal training, although it taught me a lot about the fundamentals of science and, and the applications of photonics, it did not necessarily teach me how to communicate the work I do and communicate the importance of something like the Photonics Explorer to a wide audience. And this is something that I have learned as a result of working in this project and now leading the nonprofit organization. I can still remember the first instance that I actually understood something and that uh, is a very powerful feeling and I work on a daily basis with teachers and students and when they work with the Photonics Explorer for example you see their eyes light up with a very fundamental understanding of science and when you have that understanding you can go on to apply it into fields and to do things that you never thought would be possible by yourself so I think that is a very key thing about being a researcher.